An underwater robot called UCAT, inspired by a turtle and developed by a team of engineers at Estonia's Tallinn University of Technology, is raising hopes for a new approach to maritime archaeology. It uses fins instead of propellers, giving researchers greater maneuverability. Archaeologists say it could help them examine thousands of hard-to-access Second World War shipwrecks in the Baltic Sea. For archaeology, this robot is unique because uh, there are no such robots available at the moment. The robots available are really large and really expensive and not uh, speci specially made for underwater archaeology. UCAT doesn't require a control cable that could get tangled, so it also reduces the risk of damaging sensitive underwater archaeological sites. What really sets the UCAT apart, though, is an innovation inspired by the movement of turtles. Four silicon flippers, allowing it to change direction quickly. There are different advantages that we hope to get with flippers uh, compared to the traditional propellers. And uh, the main advantage, for example, is that it won't bring up the sediment from the bottom. Archaeologists say the Baltic Sea has perfect conditions for underwater exploration, as the ships there are well preserved. You've just seen the last edition of High Tech with me at the helm. After about 20 years and more than 3,000 editions of High Tech and Science, I'd like to say thank you for watching and goodbye to Euronews viewers.